what if you have 3d geometry let me create one simple 3d geometry the same plate say plate 3d instead of cell go to the extrusion let's say 0 comma 40 create a circle at the center Point is high even 10 is more 5 is ok so this is my 3d plate component and similarly I want to split it so go to the mass and here you can see this is the sweepable but not the structured one and if you directly mass it say element search 2 go to the mass this type of unstructured massing you will get one more method you have you can change the algorithm instead of here the advanced fronting algorithm you can use, utilize the medial axis and in the medial axis algorithm we are trying to minimize the mesh transition means we are trying to minimize the variation in the mesh pattern click on ok click on yes delete and let's mess again so in this way software try to define a very smooth mass flow even if you increase the curvature control or you can say I'm going to increase the number of element around the hole click on ok mass yes surely you will get better control as compared to the previous condition but not exact what we want if you are in hurry or your model is such very complex that you cannot judge where it should split then you can utilize this technique but in this case we can easily utilize the structured massing because we know from where we have to split it so how to split see this options first let me delete the elements this options is to split the faces not the complete component so if I try to split the faces what will happen it will split the faces but not along the depth let's try select the surface that you want to split and then edge I'm creating only show splits click on done ok you can see this surface is splitted not the complete geometry and if you try to convert this into structured massing it is not possible so the one way is like you have to first split the faces then you have to drag go to the cell you have to drag or extrude the edges so I have to select the edges likewise which I want to drag yeah it is asking for the close chain this is a little bit problematic actually you cannot select the all so you have to select them individually likewise select these edges click on done direction it is asking for one direction I am selecting this axis this downward direction click on ok and create partition so one partition will be created similarly you have to create the partition as you want
but this is very lengthy for me. I am not going to utilize this options. This face options is very good for the surface geometries, but not for the solid geometries. I am going to delete these two partitions and let us move to the part modeling. In the part modeling, here we have one option that is for the cell creation. Here we have number of options, okay? But I want to utilize cell X2. This option is for generating the surfaces, but we can utilize the same options to spread the 3D geometry also. Here we have a small trick that we have to understand. So, it is asking for face where you want to create a sketch, then vertical axis. Let us create circles, circle force, yeah of course circles are for washer. Same way, nothing I'm changed. Ten and this distance was twenty. That's fine. Click on done, and now it is asking for the cell extrusion parameter. This is the direction of the cell extrusion. I want to define this extrusion in the reverse, reverse direction. This value. Okay, this is around 5. So, I have to put at least 5. I am keeping 6. And if you directly click on OK, the solid will not split. You have to check on this options. Keep internal boundaries. Let me show you. See, this solid is not splitted. Surfaces are generated over there. Go to the wireframe mode. These are surfaces. Those are generated. But this solid is not splitted. So, double click on it. Make sure you check on this options. Keep internal boundaries. Click on OK. Now, your solid is splitted. But there is one more problem. If you go to the mesh, here we have surfaces, excessive surfaces and my splitted solid also. So, I have to delete these excess surfaces somehow. So, in the part modeling itself, you have delete options, delete faces, delete surfaces. But be careful before using this options. If you select any face of the solid, it will delete that face also likewise. It convert your solid into faces and will delete one face. So, I am going to remove this command. Be careful before using this command. I want to delete only the excessive faces. So, how to select this excessive faces? One way is like you have to select these faces individually likewise and that is very lengthy. Instead of I am going to hide my solid geometries. Those are called cell. So, for the hiding, you have options here over in the display group. In display group, the second option for the hide. This is not remove actually. This is hide and this is replace and this so all. Okay? Do not consider this as a remove. Consider this as a hide. What we want to hide? I want to hide the cells. Selecting the cells or we can say selecting the solids. Click on done. So, these excessive surfaces or excessive faces will only remain. Now, you can delete those excessive faces very easily. And go to the soil. This solid geometry will be now only visible. See, in the feature tree, first solid, then we use the cell extrude command, then we use the remove command. Now, go to the massing, 
and you can see this component is converted into structured meshing if it is not converted you can go with the mesh control select and go with the structured meshing now it is very easy to mesh say global seating of 2 that's fine local seating go to the standard view local seating i want to define on these edges of course you can select these edges also likewise go to the parallel view define element size around 0 0.5 you can create a set name further if you want to modify let's say edge of HC1 click on OK now along the radial direction here also you want to modify so local seeding selecting these edges and say node by number by size by number means number of element you want to define on the edge so i want to define a size of 0 0.5 or maybe little less 0 0.25 i want to create the set click on ok now go to the mesh let's check that is ok for me that is ok for me okay go to the massing massing of complete component and again you will get this beautiful massing that will give you beautiful results of course in depth direction also you have to increase the density so by keeping this way in the mind we can split this component hook 3 component this one is basically I'm deleting the existing element of this component and let me split this go to the part modeling use the cell extrude command defining washer washer of radius around 5 let me create a more split here this distance I want to keep here long ten similarly now ten I want to define here make sure the reverse direction the most important options keep internal boundary do not forget it this distance i not remember so i'm taking around 16. it's fine so how to delete those surfaces only first go to the hide options hide the cells go to the delete delete the surfaces Go to the show geometry. Go to the mass options. Now you can see very easily this component can be matched. 
of course for this type of massing i have to split it from here and here also so let me split very quickly here also you can utilize the same command earlier we used not need to use this command you can utilize here the cell extrusion split remove this partition and uh, recreate actually it is very easy by using the cell extrusion let me show you so go to the cell extrusion select this face select the edge let me create line at the center similarly one line here at the center software automatically detect the center point click on done in reverse direction and this distance may be 40 keep internal boundary okay not even 40 i'm going to keep exact the same value so i not need to delete the excessive faces yeah see i don't have excessive faces excessive surfaces so in second case i not need to delete and let me modify but if i create one spread here now i need to delete the excessive faces go to regenerate this is my accessive face only one accessive face so i can select and delete very easily go to the mass define local seeding go to the standard view along the radial direction I want to define at least by number at least uh, four element click on ok and here also I want to define at least six element that's ok I believe along the circumference there are sufficient element if i feel those are less i can improve go to the mass mass these regions not the whole components and you will get very beautiful mass you can see here Of course, further you can increase or decrease the element density as per your requirement.